freeze frame. Hello. <clears throat> coffee, 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 coffee. This is Rough Draft Gaming Part 6. Oh, Gaming Playthrough, sorry. Part 6 of um, The Ghost of Tsushima's um, playthrough. Plus the DLC, so that's the PS5 upgrade. And uh, check out our new uh, white dye merchant provided traveler's gear. With the snows of Kamiyagata, I think it's called. Um, a little headband there. That's protecting us from the pollen that's blowing in our face right now. All right. So we opened up Toyotama. I believe that was the last. Either maybe two videos ago. I can't remember. <coughs> Although, yeah, it might have been two videos. Because we did return south to take care of a few things. Um... I th there's a lot left to do in Izu Izuhara, but we're not going to, you know, clear each region of the island one at a time. We're just not going to do that. Um, you know, we're going to stick to following the main missions with some side stuff in between. <clears throat> now, of course, we can check out these locations in order to... Um, You know, continue to upgrade our character, Jin. Plus, there's a lot uh, in the southern map that's still fogged out, so still a lot of exploring to do. But we'll save separate videos for some of the side stuff and the exploration and the upgrades. There might even be a time where I just go around and if, if we really need to upgrade for some reason, I'll just I'll, I won't even make a video. I'll just. Kuta River Bridge. You know, controlling a bridge is pretty st st strategic. Um, I kind of want to go over here and see what's going on, but <clears throat> let's take it. There's stance progress, and we're going to need that when we go to Icky Island because it is much more challenging. It had to be done. Um, so. So I'm just going to let the um What? Are we done? How did, why did I get hmm. Nice headshot. Kill enemies with the half bow. Look at that. I didn't even know that was a thing. Um there. Okay, well they saw us. That's okay. I got one of the uh, I got one of the, uh, whatever they're called, one of the bonus objectives thing. I want the, the camp leader to go away so I can observe him and then get to progress, stance progress, because after the first couple main missions of Toyotama, we are, oops, ooh, he's mad. Oh, and he runs away. Clear. Um, first couple missions of Toyotama. Uh, we gotta get out of the way first before we go to Iki Island. I really want to get. I think it's a charm, not a not a skill. I think it's a charm that you can. Um... Damn it! You can get arrows uh, that are silent on impact. I should just let them go, because he needs to go back to his practice so I can observe him. I'm just going to hang out here. Although this is probably pretty boring for the casual viewer, if there are any. I'm just watching him chill in the grass. But you know what? This is a playthrough. We have to accept the gameplay presented before us. And there's nothing anyone can do about it. Alright, so they're running away back to their little Mongol living. Well, he went right back to work. And I'll go ahead and observe him. There we go. Two stance progress, assuming I kill him. After that, we'll only need three more. 
and we'll have a better idea of how we can do it Icky Island. Alright. Oh wow, he's not even paying attention to his his people's doom. There we go. I guess we could unlock the moon stance in Icky, but honestly, we'll we'll un probably unlock it before we even get there. So, is there another guy? Oh, squirrely fucker, isn't he? <laughs> that was fun. Oh, you know what? Just, I'm not gonna waste an arrow. Anymore. Too squirrely. There's a little sidestepping. Any Mongol artifacts? No? I feel a thumping on my controller. There it is. Why did I waste that? Okay. Paitsa. Paitsa is a special tablet given to Mongol officials and enjoy uh, uh, and envoys that entitle them to certain privileges, such as the use of special supply points, as well as the ability to conscript goods and services from the civilian population. They are also distributed overseas to merchants as a means of strengthening their ties to the Mongol Empire. I hope I pronounced it right. See, in my playthroughs, you get to learn. As well as follow birds. Where are you? There you go. Oop, I just took that off. Where do you go? I was putting my katana away. Oh, there's a tent over there I haven't checked. We shall return. Take me to a pillar of honor. I want I want to find my dueling festival. It's my favorite katana in the game. Is this a haiku, I think? No? Oh shit, that's too far. Oh nice. Yeah, it is a haiku, Azuma. All right, wow, we're we're hitting a lot of the haikus. I can't believe I haven't found any pillar, hardly any pillar of honors. I usually come across a few. I mean, we've already unlocked the second island, and I, I only have a few. Oh, this is headband of the invasion. This is a good headband. Calm before the storm. Overwhelming. Constant haze envelops. I kind of like the calm before the storm and then the haze one. That's kind of a cool. What was my first one? Does overtaking all seas make sense? Uh, yeah, it does. It's, it's an overwhelming force, so. Alright, let's see here. Fleeing warmth and light. Rushing to the end. I like this because it's sort of like it switches point of view from the enemy to you. Force. Reaching from within to, to face the Overtaking challenge. Overtaking all that sees. In danger. Reaching from within. Not bad, I guess. I've written better. Or choosing, chosen the combo, a better combo. Headband of the Evasion. Let's take a look. I think it's red and gold, yes. Kind of cool. Okay. So I have a pin set. Because I th there might be a pillar of honor on this edge uh, peninsula. But I know there's one on the peninsula to the north. Who would take us over there. I think it's a shrine. There is. I can see it. I can see the pillar of honor. Okay. Let's go get it. Then maybe we'll do a mission. Up in Toyotama. Or we could do a side mission down here in Izuhara. Or we could do a main mission in Toyotama. Really, the choice is ours and ours alone. Good luck. 
citing a quote from Olmec of Legends of the Hidden Temple. I love the purple monkeys. No. Sil uh, the, the, sh the silver monkey was the shrine. The shrine of the silver monkey. Uh, what was the... Uh, was it the purple parrots? I think it was the purple parrots. Orange iguanas, red jaguars, blue barracudas. Was it the s silver snakes? Green monkeys. It was the green monkeys. I like the purple parrots, and I liked uh, the red jaguars. The silver snakes never won. Purple parrots barely won ever either. It's always the blue barracudas, the orange iguanas, or the red jaguars. The rest, they probably purposefully uh, hired inept children to play the ones, the, the color teams that never win. Okay, we've arrived at the Pillar of Honor. I was right. Check this out. Look at all these peninsulas. This peninsula has a Pillar of Honor. This peninsula has a Pillar of Honor. It's not my dueling festival, though, because I know that's not the one. A family's escape. Toku, we found a way down the cliffs. It's a dangerous climb, but it seems safer near the waterfall. The boat is meant to come tonight. You have to make it. Father says there won't be another chance. We don't want to leave without you, but we can't stay. I hope you understand. I read that in the expression that he probably wasn't feeling. So I guess if we go down the cliffs, there might be a waterfall with a secret to check out. Collect. Warrior's Brush. I kind of like that. That's a cool name. Cool imagery. Like a master calligrapher's brush stroke written in blood. That's cool. Nice. Look at this. I kind of enjoy that. I like the... Is that blue or purple? I like it. Let's let's do this one. I'm not a huge fan of the square uh, guard, but that's okay. The scabbard's pretty cool. So I think there might be a waterfall down here if the, the scroll mentioned it. So we just got to find a place to scale down the cliffs. Weirdly, there's none there. How about over here? Um, no. I wonder if I could just jump into the water. Should we? Should we do it? No, I think it'll it'll kill me before I reach the bottom. Like, it'll just do that automatic, like, ass assumption that you're doomed. Nice. Alright, there's gotta be a way down from here. You hit hide in this little pompous grass. Can't see me! I should broadcast, go live on Twitch sometime. It might be kind of fun. Just for fun. The bear's not going to be able to see me while I'm hiding here. Shit. I usually like them killing the bear first. Um, that way I don't have to deal with it. And there we go. More gear up upgrades. There is no way to scale. I wonder if there's just, just the edge of the map and I can't. I don't know. He said they scaled the cliffs, but and there was a waterfall. I wonder if there's a place named the cliffs. Ooh, could it be Sibling Rock? You know what? Fuck it. Let's go and look at Sibling Rock. I don't like swimming, but it's something to do. Is this an F around video? Possibly. There's a Sashimono banner up there. Alright. Might as well. Dude, I, don't, I accidentally pressed R1. Can I scale down this way? Make it go a little? No. I'm trying to make it go faster. Right here, though. Right? Nope. Nope. Oh, lady, you okay? That's sad. Kind of a peaceful place to be. I should turn her around facing the ocean. I'm not gonna, because I don't think it's possible. Although Sucker Punch really, really, really probably wouldn't be opposed to doing that. They love to add some detail into this game, and they're never finished with it. And the detail they add is is good. It's not arbitrary. It's a good job, Sucker Punch. Thankful for what you've done. Because I have not played a game... A newer game, at least in the past couple years, 
three years that I've truly just been awed by and just addicted to. You know, I've, I've done a lot of re-gaming. Reruns, so to speak. Um, big, big fan of the FF7 remake. I know, I think it got, what, mixed reviews? I, well, I think it was generally favored, but I know there are some people who, who did not dig it, and that's okay. I mean, everybody's got their opinion. I loved it. Uh, it was just great. I mean, nothing will beat the original, but... Oh, there's two Sashimoto banners. I'm gonna get a saddle in no time. And the waterfall might... There it is. Is that the waterfall? I wonder if... Because like, I was thinking maybe if there's a way behind the waterfall, there'd be like treasure or something. But Here, here's the... Okay, yeah, here. A family's escape is like part two. Toku, I hope there's no need for this note, and soon I'll see you come down the beach yourself. Oh, that's, that's nice. There's not much time left before the boat arrives, but I, I'll stall it as long as I can. If you do read this, I'm so sorry. Please stay safe until we can return after the Mongols are gone. If they are gone. Since I'm the ghost, they will be. Um, anyway, FF7 Remake. Oh, we're going to this fucking rock. Dude, you gotta be kidding me. I gotta swim all that way. That's right. FF7 Remake. Um, it, it, like, the original, you know, will always be my preferred version of it, but just because it, you know, it's been a part, you know, I played it when I was young and it was important to me. It was a big part of my life. Well, not life, but my love for gaming, really, and, and stories and narratives. It's great. And it was amazing to, like, relive it, but in a whole new next gen. Fully detailed, realistic, beautifully, well, yeah, beautifully designed, and the graphic, oh, it's just, it was amazing to relive some of my favorite moments from at least the first third of the game, um, in a new way, in a next-gen way, and I think they did a fantastic job. Even the liberties they took weren't, weren't terrible. I don't know how I feel about how they introduced Sephiroth, so... Separate, uh, so soon. I always forget if it's Sepha or Sepha. Because he wasn't... He didn't really come in until later. I mean, he was... I think... Was there a flashback early? Maybe a hint of him, but I, he didn't appear until... Like, you know, the second act, I guess you could say. Or the, maybe even the second disc. Can't remember. It's been a long time. But the point I'm trying to make is... I also don't know about those little, like, hooded ghosty things, but I know that there were hooded figures in Nibelheim, Nibelheim um, during that flashback. They're all numbered, and they had a lifespan. And I think maybe they're connected to that, in a way, just presented it in a, in a new, new way. So, is that everything we can do? I just went over there for Sashimono banners? That's it? Seems like a lot of, a lot of work for a reward, but I maybe not a massive reward. Is there anything else? No vibration in the controller, so I guess, I guess we're good. How many saddles do we need? Oh yeah, that's right. We still have a lot. Seven. That sucks. But again, there are eighty. All right. Well, I'm gonna fast travel. We. This is twenty minutes in, so. Let's go ahead and come up here. We could do a sensei. We get the Norio ones kicked off, but I'd rather I'd rather clear some of the sensei and Masuko missions, simply because uh, there's going to be a lot going on. Kenji has three. Yuna's got four. Wow. I hate how they they give you the missions ahead of time so you can like skip parts. I'm not a big fan of that. I don't even know if you can skip parts, but. Uh, well, we should probably do the Gosaku. I'll do a Gosaku video next. I really don't know what I want to do. Um, let's go ahead and do a main mission. We'll contact the Shogun. We need samurai reinforcements if we're going to save our home. The Shogun can provide them, but only if we contact him to request more forces. Lord Shimura knows a pirate named Goro. 
skilled enough to break through the Mongol blockade and deliver our request. I should be able to find him in the smuggler's den of Amugi Cove. Okay, this is the one where we get to use a Hwacha on the ships. This is fun. Alright, so let's, uh, it's up north here. Let's find a good, oh, we have a long way to go. Norio's here. No I think, we'll, you know, there's 40 minutes. We'll be able to get there and uh, play the mission, I think. We just can't get too distracted along the way. I know that's easier said than done. And the next video, I think I'll do the Gosaku cause, armor, because I want to take that to Iki. It's my favorite armor in the game. I think. All right. Traveling to the southern Amugi Prefecture. It's about 1.3 kilometers away. We'll be passing by, I think it's a dead, dead Man's Cove or something like that, uh, where you would enter uh, the DLC content. Travel to Iki Island. Iki. Icky sounds like it's sticky and gross. Okay. I want more charm slots, so I know we're not gonna get too distracted. But I do want I do want to do the fox den. The more charms the better when you the further you progress in the game. I mean the more charms the better in general. But trust me, you're gonna want more charms. Especially if you're playing at a higher difficulty. We're just doing straight medium right now. And if we were doing New Game Plus, we would be doing Medium Plus, which I haven't really noticed a, a big challenge increase in, in any in Medium Plus, or any of the pluses, really. Um, not a big deal. There's, there's a little, but it's barely noticeable, in my opinion. I mean, but they at the same time, I mean, there's only so much difficulty they could probably program... Um, in uh can we even it, what no it's pointing me in a direct is there an ocean here oh i guess that is the map that's part of the map okay it looked like there was like an ocean or something or like a split in the island i thought but... whatever yeah right uh right here yeah, that's all water. So, I can't cross that unless I go along the coast. I guess we're going to have to go up along the coast. We'll come across uh, the entrance to um, Iki Island. It's right in here. Peasant anguished moaning. Yeah, this is where you would get What's on the boat here? to go to Iki Island. Kind of, it kind of hurts the flavor of the narrative and progression when you have to go through there and ignore the suspicious activity and the 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 need of the citizens. I don't want to ignore it. I want to do it, but we're on a time limit. I guess maybe I shouldn't. Maybe I, no, no, because I don't want to go to the DLC yet. Kind of having a little bit of chemo brain today. Yeah, I should. You know, I'm gonna stand off. I, you know, I don't have time to stand around. Do I get two? Yeah, that's right. I don't like that. There are. Well, I'm gonna get him first. They throw things that are annoying. Damn, you snuck up. cut at him. Alright. Is there a predator hide over here? I got you, son. Soon. You're good. I'd given up hope before you came. Go. Be well. It's not much, but please take it. Oh, almost. We could have been a contender.
All right. Well, yeah. Sorry, you're just staring at each other. That was awkward. All right. Let's get back on the horse. Come on. You know what, bird? I, well, he might. Well, is there a pillar of honor nearby? Because if not, I'm not going to follow the bird. Fine, I'll follow the bird. Only, well, it's going to take me to a location. Which I guess isn't bad. It gives me a, a fast travel point. Oh, okay. So these, look at this. Now, look at it. Um, right here. Um, these do not count towards any uh, trophy progress or completion progress when you platinum a game. But these are just little Easter eggs for fun. You bow to this and you get a little response from nature. Like these little fish. If you can find all of these, you get, I think you get a reward, but you don't get any trophy or anything. So. Don't worry if you don't find all of them. I mean, you can always look up online. And honestly, I probably won't include those in the walkthrough or playthrough unless I just randomly come across them. I love those birds. I don't think they're added for the PS5. I just don't remember him from the original playthrough. Oh, shoot, there's a bear on its hind legs. That's dangerous. Sorry, dude. I like bears, but... And you're probably not attacking me, but... I need those hides, man. I gotta save an island. And there's going to be... Sa ah, ha, 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 ha! There we are. The pillar of Anna. I'm glad I followed that bird. What's this say? What's this say? Do I bow to this? Can I bow to this? Do things happen? I want to line up. I want to line up with it just in case. I want to see if I can. Damn it, fuck. Damn it. Uh. No! Stand up! Does something happen? Oh, yeah, look, another one. Except those are uh, dragonflies. Now I gotta deal with these assholes wasting my time. Right in the face. Why do I? Why do I keep getting technique? Oh, this is a different uh, group of bad guys. Dang, they were all over the place. There's two different separate groups of baddies. Dude, this dude is hardy. Will this work? Glad that worked because nothing else did. Oh. <laughs> I like fighting as a Ronin. Oh shit. I should probably switch. I have, see, I have no. Dang. Fighting like Boromir to the very end. Ooh. Traveler's gear sucks against these guys. We don't have to be so dramatic about it. Oh, you know what? I should probably go get the uh, katana. That you know, the whole point of this. All right, what do we got here? Whoop. Breath of Hachiman. Let the kami of the samurai guide your blades. I thought I already had this one. Oh no, I just his embers. Kind of similar. All right. We're at a half hour, so I think we can still do it. Twenty, fl Twenty flowers. It would be prefecture, so we're in the right prefecture now. That's a good sign. Less than six hundred meters to go. Come on, dude! No, no, no! I'm like now. 
Go away. Don't see me. Oh, over there we have the uh, field of red flowers. It's beautiful. There's actually a, a duel there. A duel among the spider lilies or something. Kind of cool. This little wooded area. Whew. Bleomycin damage to the lung is getting to me today. Light of breath. I'm gonna make another video after this, but I must say I might take a little break in between. I think these are called spider lilies. The red flowers that you see to the right. Me being the uh, Tsushima tour guide. Oh yeah, up there I think is a duel. No, that's just a camp. Alright. I might want well, I'm gonna go over here and see if I can unlock a location for fast travel point. Well, not that I'm gonna unlock this place just in a second, but Field of the Equinox flower. Okay, so I guess is that the name of the type of flower? Or is it a spider lily? i we'll just say it's an equinox flower. So I think there's a, a shrine to a fox around here because I can hear the uh, the discovery music. The question is where the fuck is it? And I promised everyone, including myself, that I wouldn't get distracted. And here I am. Oh, that's well hidden. And the fox appears. It's like that fucking movie Antichrist with Willem Dafoe. That freaking fox speaks to him. Like the old colonial settlers, you know, like the women would hallucinate. Well, the men would, I mean, they would get delirious and sick. Either from the stress of survival on the colonial frontier, settled settlements and all that, or, uh, um, or they get sick, like literally, like actually sick. Um, and they'd hallucinate you know, weird things with animals. I read some primary documents in college about, you know, of, of uh, journal entries from some of these uh, settlers and the things they described were nuts. All right, we can't do the haiku. It's not enough time. Dude, I was just right by the... You gotta be fucking kidding me. I'm, t I'm focusing on talking and not focusing on the mission, and we're running short of time. So anyway, back to, uh, back to this. I think the movie The Witch, the Robert, I think it's Robert Eggers, I think that's his name. The guy who did Lighthouse. Um, I think he did a good job portraying that aspect of the settlers. Uh, the characters went through all that hallucinations, and... You know, all that stuff. But he did consult primary documents when he when he made that, I remember. Um, probably I mean, that's where they got the language for the script. Alright, so oh, I have to search him again. I'm look, I'm trying to do the wind. Uh Alright, what's my radius? Oh my gosh. Uh, you know, this might be a waste of a video. For at least mission. We had a good talk, didn't we? But we dicked around and unlocked some stuff. Got some housekeeping done. So is this uh, is this what I'm looking for? These dudes? I'm looking for the pirate, right? Yeah. Well, maybe these guys have some answers. I'm gonna shoot him in his hat. <laughs> they turn around and look at him, even though they clear. Oh, see me. Hey, we have the same hat. Where'd you get yours? Just sports? Oh, 
I got, you got a kunai in the throat. <laughs> Have this. Oh, I missed? How do you miss? <sighs> I hear somebody suffering. I'd like to end it. Oh, maybe he just died slowly. Oh, wait, over here? Huh. Whatever. All right, so there's nothing over here. Oh, that wasn't somebody dying. That was a boar. Okay, boars uh, tend to attack you if you're not on horseback. Um, but usually all you got to do is spook them. You know, by killing one. Creating fire, and they'll go away. Horse is chilling far away. All right, we're searching a Moogie Cove, but I don't even remember for what, so. I guess we're looking for a Mo Moogie Cove. Yeah, search for a Moogie Cove, you dumb shit. I, uh... Keep a brain and blue dream. I guess, is this it? Return to the so Oh, jeez, it's not. This is on the outskirts. That's a mindfuck. All right. I'm a professional gamer. I'm not. Damn, I am out of it. Look at this. Ah. Oh. I feel like a cove might be on the coast. So let's... Is that part of our search radius? Yes. Now let's head towards that smoke. Maybe that's what we're looking for. Search radius is big enough. So we got, what, what, a little less than 23 minutes? I really don't see why we couldn't do this mission. It's a bamboo... You know what? We've come this far with doing nothing. Let's fucking just keep going. Ah, shit. So easy. I... There we go. Reminds me of my college days. Just massive... Oh! Massive procrastination. Got it. I didn't think I pressed... I thought I pressed the uh, side of circle. And, oh, it's increased. That is helpful. I uh, thought I missed circle by pressing the side. I love how you can collect the bamboo you cut down. That's sucker punch. That's clever. Oh, is that it? Oh, we made it. Cool. There we go. It only took a long time. 11 or 19 minutes, right? To go? Yeah. Wait, no. You're stupid. It's like 20 minutes. No! 21! No oh shit. Wait a minute. I guess the Moogie Cove has some bad guys in it? No. Those guys aren't going to harm me. Okay. Halt, Ronin. Yeah, dude. It's your business. Oh, let me let me do this. He called me a Ronin. I might as well look the part. I'm not a Ronin. My name is Jin Saga. Well, a samurai. Lady Sanjo will want to see you. Reach down here and get my water. Excuse She's me. She's in charge of Ronin. Please come with me. This way, my lord. It's important you speak to the lady. Professional. Drinking water and crackle in the bottle, right in front of the camera. I want to see what this merchant has. Ooh, armor dot, new. Oh, I wish I could see it, but it's dark. And we know this game hates interior lighting. Lethal aristocrat, amber assassin, Rafan, predator, twilight strider. An 
honor to assist your fight. If you can bring more, it's yours. Oh, it, he had some some hats too. Ooh, I like that. Yeah. I'll see you again. We're good. I know. I have a lot of victories. It's what I fucking do. Hell yeah! You always upgrade Only the best for you. Yeah. Boom. Worthy I like that. That's somebody. that's some satisfying upgrades. All right, where is this dude? Follow the gun to meet Lady Sanjo. I think she's up up top. The, the, the head dudes are always up top. Although, why would he? Okay. Sucker punch, sucker punch me there. All right, I got to do the wind because I don't know where he went. <laughs> and we're running short on time. Dude, I'm following the wind. Oh my gosh, I'm sorry. I am so turned around. I, sh I, you know what? We should just let it count down, and I'll, it'll set me back up with him. Unprofessional. This way, my lord. It's important you speak to the lady. All right, I'm I'm behind you now, man. I, there was just a lot of pretty shiny things to that got that distracted me, including that fucking merchant. And I just forgot he was inside, not elsewhere. Lord Sakai, this is Lady. I was Sakai. right though; she is on the upper floor. I see the Mongols haven't found this place. Thankfully, no. There hasn't been bloodshed here. I gotta call the IRS years. at 1:30. Anyone who draws a weapon answers After to my men. Video. Your safety is assured. My amendment so is So long late. as you abide by that same rule. Now please, tell me how I may help you. I'm looking for a smuggler named Guru. <laughs> Interesting. He is downstairs, having his third bottle of sake. Mmm, dealing with a person with who's a little bit... Thank you. Come see me drink it, drinky dependent. I think we can help each other. Journal updated. The del uh, delicate art of negotiation. <sighs> Wait a minute. Are we done? Is this is that the mission? Yes. Okay. So, what? Oh, okay. I guess it just introduces it. Needs. I'm a little confused. I thought I was in the mission. I guess the mission was just talking to her. Okay. Well, I guess consider our little journey we took uh, part of the mission. Okay. I thought I was all stressed out about the time. You know what we could do? Let's go. Let's go back. Go back here and uh, we'll start Gosaku because um, no that, no that one no is just a story and then you can you can uh, pursue the uh, the mission for that uh, on your own time. It's not one long mission. It, it's it's uh, little p pieces. You basically have to liberate, I think, some farms and uh, rescue some people. And then um, you can get the Gosaku armor. You just have to, you can go to those places in between missions and stuff. It's not all at the same time. So let's go start it. And that way we open it up for the next video. Because, I mean, honestly, to be real, the chances are that we probably might not be able to get all the farms liberated in one video. So we might as well start now. I think there's six or eight. Lord Sakai, please join me. The tale of Gosaku. Oh, short of breath, man. 
Recovery sucks, man. Tell me about him. Gladly, my lord. Two and a half centuries ago, Tsushima was terrorized by the Red Hand Bandits of Akashima. Around this time, a farmer named Gosaku heard the spirit oh, of a dead samurai calling to him. Farms. He found the body, still clad in brilliant armor. Overwhelmed by the armor's beauty, Gosaku stole it. I remember. Before long, the Red Hand reached yeah, Gosaku's home. Knowing the farmers would lose everything if the bandits went unchallenged, Gosaku donned the samurai's armor. The bandits charged. Kosaku's sword arm trembled in fear. He resigned himself to death. But blow after blow glanced off the armor, and Gosaku did not falter. Yeah, you do get some good defense with this one. The I love this armor. I love the design. Back, tripping over their feet. It's a freaking regal. Sense of calm it's good, it's good armor. Gosaku's body and mind. Impressed by Gosaku's bravery, the dead samurai spirit guided his blade. Before long, Gosaku cut down the final bandit, and the Red Hand were never seen again. Years later, when Gosaku died, the farming families locked the armor away for safekeeping. Each family holds a single key to the lock. Now, Terra. That's right. Our you gotta get the again. keys from the farmers. The farmers of Tsushima. Which I knew, had, had, I just forgot it was key related. Because then you, you go to the uh, to protect our this little like once more. pathway into a mountain. The doorways carved into the mountain like uh, like in Lord of the Rings. Going into Moria like Melon. Um, and then you go and use the key on the on that mountain door. And there's the armor now inside. The Mongols are hunting for Raiding farms across the island in search of the keys. Which farmsteads hold the keys? Oh. Aoi, Ijima, Kuta, Koshimizu, Ohama, and Yagata. If so, you find that six, keys, I wasn't counting. I think it was. The armor is hidden on a hilltop in Akashi. <sighs> the Mongols will never lay hands on it. Of that, I am certain. But I definitely have to take a break after this one. I have to go get my oxy, ox, oximeter, oximeter. I don't know what it's called. Check my oxygen. It was 97, no, 98 early. That's really good. That's good. Okay. Well, let's see if we have time to get one. So here they are. I guess we'll start from the bottom. Start it from the bottom. Now we hit. drive-by collecting all right so the thing about these it's got to be stealthy so we're gonna have some fun and look creepy and what katana do we have i want that doesn't matter let's do that one all right rescue the hostages kill enemies without being seen so honestly we have two approaches you can just run in and kill everything while protecting the hostages from the Attackers like the skull and crossbone ones, but we get a bonus If we're not seen and that's good because um, When we go to Iki Island, we want to be leveled up damn it. All right All right, well Will they go after the hostages? They don't. We can maybe just hide up here. Cause just because they see you doesn't necessarily mean they won't give up looking. And I don't see him going after any hot. Oh boy! Did not see him come. All right, here we go. All right, so I failed at that. I'll, I'll, I well, maybe it's just best because we're running. We only have ten minutes left. Oh, he's gonna get to them in time. I think we failed. I think we're gonna have to do this again. I got seen. Yep, he got him. 
All right. Let's, uh... Hey, sometimes that happens. How many Dark Souls uh, playthroughs I've seen where the people are just unbelievably good, but they still die, you know? Of course, that's Dark Souls. It's a different challenge, but it's gaming, man. And here I am running through the place I'm supposed to be quiet in. Okay, so we don't have to worry about anything over there. Oh, uh, dude, I don't want... Oh, hold on. Oh, I don't have... Ah, oh, shoot, I only have the loud arrows. <laughs> Alright, well, I'm at a disadvantage now. Because I can't pick people off from a distance. And the only arrows I do have, I have two of them, and they create a lot of noise. And that dude has a hawk. Or a falcon. <laughs> Not anymore. Alright. Oh, he's mad. He's shaking his fist. He's pissed off at God. Well, he keeps looking in this direction. Ah, I'll go this way. Yeah. Alright. Did I... Oh, I already did. Yeah, I failed that bonus objective. No, I didn't. Why is it... Oh, maybe you only get one shot and then it takes it away. Because I have to eliminate the enemies without being seen. Okay, whatever. We'll just get it the next time. In fact, we don't do a lot of stealth in this playthrough so far. I usually take the traditional samurai path and face my enemy with courage and honor. I'm wasting my time here. Can I do... I can do a chain assassin from the top. That's fun. Oop. Gotta go around here. Got my kunai back. Oh, hey! Boy, I wish I wasn't seen for that brief second. Although I might have that might have been the last time. You know, I you know, I don't know. I'm braining, chemo braining it out right now. Hold still. So I don't think this is, they have three hostages, so you, once you reach the third, they'll give you the key. It doesn't really matter which hostage. Whoever's the last one has the key. It could be him, if I rescued him last. All right, let's look for some red bodies. That'll indicate the next area. Probably over here. Oh, we got a technique. I have the far sight now, right? Yeah. Oh, what should I... Oh, let's see. I want that, so... Well, real quick, I'm going to be... I don't need that yet. Pairing projectiles is always useful, but it also... Leads me down the path where I'm one step closer to gaining the resolve from parrying. Because resolve is important. The other thing that's important is finishing this in six minutes. Which I might have to get action packy. And not stealthy wealthy. And I have no... Do I have arrows? Did I collect those? Did I get those back? Yeah, I have 12 of them, but I'm going to do this because that was from very far up. Actually, There's no other way. That katana, there was no other way. It's, you got to go the cool way. Whew, that was close. Dangerous. You know, we could, there's nobody, I don't see anybody. It's just, you know, let me help you out. Oh. Oh, I thought it would give me the prompt.
Dude. I hate how it, it switches on you. Whatever, it doesn't even matter. I'll be free soon. I accomplished that. We got a little less than five minutes. Four and a half. All right, we got it. Be careful up there. That only took like a minute and a half, so. The long part is just finding where to go next. I think it's down here. Yeah. Closer to the beach. Of course, this one's... Ha <laughs> ha! Hurrah! Oh, that's good it hit him because I thought I was gonna go over him. Yeah, let's just let's just fuck the stealth, because you don't even get the bonus anymore, so. Anybody else? No? Alright, I think we've won. This person um should have the key. This is the third hostage. Where are you? Doesn't even matter, your master's gone. Yeah, I got you. All right. You saved us. Did they find your key to Kosaku's armor? <laughs> he could have the key for all I care. Kosaku is a hero from a children's story. You don't believe the armor exists? Not at all. Take our key and see for yourself, my lord. Okay, key of. I Aoi, Aoi, one of six keys said to lead to Gosaku's armor, gifted by the farmers of Aoi village. And this is what it looks like. All right, three minutes left. Oop. All right, we liberated that. All right, get that food going, farmers. Let's feed our people. Wait, I, I did the bonus objective? But I was seen. Over there. Okay, well, I'll hey, I'm gonna take it. I'll tell. I'm not complaining. But I'm a little confuzzled. Servant of the people. What's this? Say? Oh, we could do that next. Well, no, we're gonna do more Kusaku. Ooh, what's this? Is there stuff here that's cool? Oh. What's down here? Oh, yeah. Uh, let's travel to the next farm. Which is right here. We'll, we'll go close to it. And then, uh, we'll approach it. And then we'll end the video there. That way we can kick it off. I mean, I could always start it, but nah, I'm not going to do that. Oh, is it right here? We're already here. All right, well. All right, kill enemies in a row without taking damage. Uh, that's doable. This Tai Lu would say. Even though they failed. Go sons. Alright, I'm not gonna do anything. I don't wanna get caught in the middle because I'm gonna actually probably turn off and not pause. So I'm gonna take a break. So anyway, I am freeze frame. Thank you for watching. If there are anybody is there is anybody watching. Um, this is rough draft gameplay walkthrough game <laughs> gaming playthroughs. And uh, that'll be my new thing, is just butchering my own sign-on and sign-off title. But it's rough draft for a reason. I don't have all fancy equipment. I mean, if I did, I could I could set up. I mean, I have good, good equipment, I just don't have a good setup in editing. It's expensive. Well, I will st I'm going to make another video soon. Another, maybe one one or two more tonight and uh yeah you guys have a great rest of your day <laughs>